So hello again. I'm glad to see you all here uh, with us today. And before starting our webinar, I have a small question. Uh, could you confirm in the chat window that you can hear me and can uh, that you can see my slides? Uh, it would be very helpful if I will know that everything is okay uh, with our technology. So thanks, Jeremy. Thanks for confirming. And so my name is Pranas. I'm Operational Marketing Project Executive at Teltonica Networks. And today I'm not alone. Uh, my company is Vitanis Petkus, Head of Sales in East America Region, and IT Engineer Shivang Amin. So today we will explore the potential of industrial 5G market in North America. Uh, we will discuss what is driving the growth and what new business possibilities 5G opens. And in the end, we will have dedicated Q&A session. So if you have any questions, please write it down in Q&A section. So I would like to start with statistics. If we would look down into trends of revenues generated by seller router and gateways by region, we clearly see that the highest growth is projected in America's region. So why so? The average device selling price in the Americas region is significantly higher than in Europe and Asia Pacific. This is because the Americas is leading the adoption of 5G devices, which are more expensive compared to other technologies. And if we would take a look into global seller router and gateway shipments by technology, we can clearly see that 4G is still holding strong positions. But from 2021, one technology is increasing in terms of shipment amount, and it's 5G. In 2023, 29% of all seller connections was 5G in North America. And it was 197 millions of connected devices. It is projected that in 2028, this number of connections will grow to 700 millions. Just imagine how many devices it will be needed. So this growth is unavoidable because 5G technology has a number of features which is positively impact digital experience and industrial use cases. 5G enables much higher data rates and enables to transfer data more quickly. Much lower latency means compressing the time between sending and receiving the data. This allows users to experience less delay or lag when requesting data from the network. A latency of milliseconds would be noticeable to humans. Moreover, with the new networks, speed and latency, it doesn't get worse even with thousands of connected devices. 5G actually offers more device density. It increases capacity as the network expands. And this means in addition to personal devices such as smartphones, tablets and PCs, also, many other industrial devices and sensors will be capable of communicating it with each other in the same network. So let's look what impact does it have on industrial IoT. Data-driven design is a powerful tool that can be used to improve the efficiency, productivity, quality, and innovation in industrial processes. 5G allows to plan manufacturing process backed by real-time data. Data as a service can be a valuable tool for businesses of all sizes that want to leverage the power of data to improve their operations. 5G provides the ability to have on-demand access to real-time data streams in easy-to-use formats. And with the help of 5G, we are able to gather all important data without any delay from anywhere. It helps to make on-time decisions and take actions in the exact moment when they are needed. Significant reduction of downtime and improved productivity and output can be achieved with continuous analysis of equipment condition to reduce unexpected machine failure. So how do we benefit from 5G? With 5G era, it became possible not to only remotely monitor and configure IT devices, but also control them from anywhere despite the location. With single digit millisecond latency, it is possible to control equipment as we would be at the same site. Connectivity-based services act as a nervous system of industrial IoT. It enables the flow of information that fuels insights and drives innovation in the industrial sector. IoT adoption empowers industries to streamline operations, make data-driven decisions, improve safety, and unlock new possibilities for innovation and growth. It is told that with 4G, everyone was connected, and with 5G, everything will be connected. 
5G opens new horizons to connect countless number of devices into one network. And all of this allows us to increase the productivity level of our industry because we become constrained by industrial ecosystem which can work in collaboration. And what is the most important? All of this allows us to create new business cases which would not be possible with old generation connectivity devices and networks. So at this point, I would like to invite Vitanis to talk about how Teltonica networks can help you to explore all the benefits of 5G connectivity. Uh, hello, everybody. Uh, thank you, Pranas, for the introduction. Uh, guys, here you, I, I hope you hear me well. Uh, so uh, what Teltonica brings and our first footstep with the 5G product is uh, RGT M50. I hope everybody has a good eyes in North America to watch this presentation after a solar eclipse yesterday. So, uh, you know, I hope you guys enjoy it. So, as I mentioned, this is the first product of ours uh, on, on the 5G technology. Now, uh, I want to talk about the, the some of the physical features uh, uh, of the product. So, it supports uh, standalone and non-standalone uh, 5G uh, technology. Uh, of course, one of the main 5G uh, technology features is is the speed. Uh, in a some co in the perfect conditions, this router RET M50 are able to achieve up to 3.4 gigabits per second speed. Uh, also, is uh, reverse comparable uh, to Cat19 uh, LTE connectivity. So, if 5G network is is not there available, this router still supports. Uh, 4G and uh, it it is dual SIM product, so you know you can use uh, different uh, operators in in North America to assure the seamless and uninterrupted connection to your solutions. Now, uh, uh, more about the interfaces itself. So obviously, M50 is equipped with four uh, gigabit Ethernet ports, uh, dual band Wi-Fi. Uh, connectivity it's wi-fi 5 uh, as i mentioned dual sim uh, gps and gnss uh, uh, location availabilities and usb interface uh, the product itself at the moment is fully ready for usa and canada market uh, uh, except verizon uh, verizon uh, is giving us hard times to be honest uh, to get certified but it's just around the corner and we are expecting the certification for Verizon uh, and device to be fully compatible with all operators to be done in the beginning of Q3. Now, what what uh, what device is powered by? So it's our own root OS, uh, multiple VPN support, uh, multiple industrial protocol support, uh, extensive remote man uh, management by our RMS system which I'm going to present uh, a little bit uh, more in detail with our uh, technical person, Shivang, uh, later on. But very important thing that all of the developments and updates uh, on RUT OS is free of charge. And uh, every uh, user of the router uh, is, you know, getting uh, those full functionality from the get-go. Basically, from the start, when you start using it, you get the full functionality. There's no additional costs involved. You are ready to operate a router to the full extent. Now, I want to give a word to Shivang and demonstrate uh, our RMS system and his ca capabilities live. So, Shivang, I'm stop sharing. The floor is yours. Thank you, Vitanes. Hmm? Uh, allow me to share my screen. Are you guys able to see my screen? Yes. Perfect. So this is the dashboard for the remote management system that we have for our devices. Um, you can add multiple uh, devices in there. So we have root support, we have TRB gateways, we have DCR, we have tab access point, we have our managed switches and we have outdoor um, router that we can add and manage uh, through the RMS. We can access these devices remotely. So uh, using this RMS link, the RMS gives us the capability to reach to the devices remotely. Uh, to the remote web UI, we can log into the device and we can reach the web UI as well as the CLI. So I have already made a connection, an SSH connection to one of my device over here. So I can interact with the devices in web UI and the CLI remotely. 
In fact, the cool feature about the RMS is the remote uh, RMS connect remote access. This gives the give, this gives me the access to our LAN devices. So root M50 has a camera connected to its LAN port one, which I'm able to access through RMS link. So I created one of the link to the uh, using the R root M50 remote access feature. Let me show you how I did that. Here is a port section, which takes a few seconds to like scan. And once it's there, I get a nice topology of the devices that are connected on the LAN network. So here are a couple of devices that are connected to the LAN network of the root M50. And using the plus sign over here, I created the remote access to the camera. So I can in fact now see the camera, uh, I can interact with the camera, I can configure the camera and make the changes, whatever configuration changes that are needed. Not only the camera, it is capable of re reaching the remote desktop. It is It supports remote desktop protocol, which is normally used for um, accessing the computers remotely. And VNCs and other protocols are supported as well for the remote access. Using RMS, you can uh, see the location of the devices, where are they located. You can mark the device location and you can collect and see lots and lots of information about the devices. So these are the information about the devices that the RMS collect, and it will display it to your fingertips to the RMS portal. With more information on the RMS, um, there are a lot of things that you can do. We can have Wi-Fi uh, and hotspot monitoring on the device. We can have a bunch of uh, devices that can be controlled, can, that can be monitored even if one configuration needs to be changed, we can use task manager or we can use the device configuration feature uh, that will allow us to change just one configuration on let's say hundreds of devices at the same time. So it is more than a tool that makes your life easier for connecting uh, multiple devices and managing the multiple devices using the RMS. So this is a short introduction. Uh, feel free to have more questions on, about the RMS. You, we will uh, answer the questions. Even there are resources on YouTube and uh, Wiki pages that we, which you can access. I'll pass on the stage to Vidanas. Thank you. Thank you, Shivang. That was really uh, informative. Uh, thank you for this uh, live uh, ses session. So I also uh, want to talk a little bit more about RMS pricing and where how Teltonica edges with RMS system and specifically now for the new uh, users and, and current users of IRT and 50. We are very competitive. Our RMS system is not mandatory. It can be used on demand. It's a credit based system and basically uh, MSRP cost of the credit per device per month. It's uh, $2.2. So basically for $26.4 on MSRP price, you are having an access to RMS for a year for one device. So it's, uh, you know, again, it's not mandatory. Our competition, uh, most of the American companies uh, are, con you know, tiding you to the product. You cannot use the product if you don't have the cloud. Teltonica went other way. We give the flexibility on RMS. And also, in addition, we have RMS packs for one free and uh, for three, five, and ten years, and that can also be uh, discussed uh, with more detail with the you know your your respected sales manager or with your reseller or distributor where you're sourcing the product. Okay, uh, so uh, you know we we have the technology, 4G technology, mostly covering still a lot of uh, of use cases as Pranas mentioned. But 5G is stepping in and I specifically want to talk uh, further about, you know, these verticals where Teltonica's uh, 5G technology was, was already uh, executed. Uh, Teltonica 5G product was already used uh, worldwide and in North America's soil. So one of the very popular use cases where Teltonica is leader globally, uh, not yet in America, is a public transport connectivity. Abilities to connect you know, multiple sensors uh, to the M50, multiple uh, terminals. It can be the POS terminal, ticket terminal. Ability to connect the uh, advertising screen, uh, you know, configure the landing page on, uh, on the Wi-Fi connectivity. Uh, gives uh, 
very wide range of functionality uh, for the one device uh, uh, to, to you know reduce the cost of the total solution and help us to win a lot of projects worldwide. So we are now entering North America's market with M50 and we expect the same success uh, uh, on North America's soil. Uh, another very interesting use case is this basically uh, uh, self-driving uh, farming tractors. So as you know, where the driverless uh, technology is requesting very little or no latency in perfect world scenario, this is what 5G uh, uh, technology allows us to produce and uh, already this this customer in particular in the west usa in, in california using our products and and has a very good feedback uh there you know uh, how how the the whole uh, uh, architecture worked for him uh, where teltonic m50 was implemented no complaints so far so really really proud to have uh, this client in our portfolio and driverless technology is definitely one of the business uh, one of the verticals uh, you or with your partners, you can uh, attack and, and find your clients in there. It, major, uh, I would say number one uh, use case so far in Europe and in Australia with our partners is uh, RV camping uh, stations or uh, recreational vehicles, in other words, uh, where you, uh, you know, Every, everybody needs to stay connected wherever they are in the woods, in the mountains, in the valleys. So, you know, without a Wi Fi, nobody imagined their day. So, our technology, our product allows to do all of those actions uh, while you're on the travel with your RV. As well, uh, I want to mention that uh, our technical team and, and Teltonic itself uh, has a solution uh, combined with Starlink. That's basically our router works as a backup uh, where Starlink uh, satellite uh, connectivity is not available to make again solution uh, more cost effective and uh, and it can choose this you know over 5G, 4G or satellite connectivity depending on the location and the situation. Also, uh, we we are providing devices to top, pop up event connectivity so. Any any fair outside fair, there is no uh, landline internet available. RUT and 50 can provide seamless connectivity throughout uh, one of the SIM cards uh, over 5G or LTE. Again, the ab availability to provide the Wi-Fi to connect the additional third-party devices like digital signage screens or POS terminals uh, works basically as a standalone solution for uh, all the connectivity needs in 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 such in such scenarios. One thing we are very proud of, we cannot tell the name yet, but actually we start working with the biggest uh, electrical vehicle manufacturer in the US. I guess it's not hard to, to guess who it is, but uh, uh, Teltonica RUT M50 are already in Europe and in US been implemented to the EV chargers. What it helps to, you know, uh, remotely manage and maintain the stations as well as provide wi-fi services uh, secure connectivity uh, to, to collect the payments if the charger station uh, allows to do it again full full package uh, using m50 and and the solution is fully covered uh, very recent case in in canada this time uh, we were provided uh, providing uh, seamless con and secure connectivity to the voting machines in, in one of the elections so uh, uh, RUT M50 was used to provide that secure and seamless connectivity. Uh, this is really a big opportunities, election happening everywhere in North America, in, in, in Canada and in US. So that's another vertical which we tackled with our uh, 5G solution. Obviously CCTV, uh, you know, and the temporary surveillance solutions, uh, again, uh, where the 24-7 connectivity is needed, let's say, for streaming video services uh, and CCTV. Uh, RUT M50 works perfect because, again, it, it can have LAN connectivity if that goes down SIM 1, if that goes down SIM 2. So basically, you are you have two backups uh, and, and, uh, and for the security reasons, you will not lose the connection for, for one second. Uh, yeah, so that's I presented uh, some of the use cases, but this is very only very few of them. We have over 100 on our website. If you, when you have time, uh, jump on it and, and look. There is a 
very clear, uh, you know, explanations, how Teltonica product was used, what problem was solved, you have the topology. And uh, uh, now, you know, with, uh, coming with M50, we, we are obviously bringing affordable 5G product to North America's market. Uh, what it means, the MSRP price of, of this device is uh, $499. Uh, you can source it from one of our uh, distributors, partners in USA and, and Canada. As well, you can source it directly from Teltonica uh, by filling the inquiry uh, uh, in, on our website uh, or co connecting your, with your uh, respected sales manager or account manager uh, for the quote. Uh, what I want to highlight, guys, that the lead time for this product doesn't matter the quantities, is the most is up to four weeks. So you can supply to the project uh, even thousand of units within one month. Uh, it comes with 24 months standard warranty. That warranty can be extended to five years, depending on the on the project requirements. On in addition, we also offer a hardware uh, root OS and RMS rebranding for the companies who 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 who, are, who wants to do that and see value in having their own name on all of the you know on the products and and operational system and rms uh, so yeah that's you know what what you are getting in a nutshell is as i mentioned full root os functionality frequent and free of charge updates uh, customizable firmware uh, options flexible remote management uh, without long term uh, you know commitments as i mentioned it's 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 optional the client can choose this to use rms or not use rms I would say 95% of our clients does use the RMS because of the functionalities and uh, and price advantage. And of, of course, it's gonna, it helps you to stay competitive and create new business niches. I presented a couple of use cases, but much more to come. So I want to sum up in that what we try to bring is precision, efficiency, and optimization for our, for our clients and their solutions. And Let's jump in, in the Q&A section. And I, I give the word now to Pranas and <clears throat> stop sharing. No, please don't don't stop sharing. You can leave the okay. slide on. Uh, okay. Thank you, Vitanis. Thank you, Shivang. It was nice to hear all this introduction of newest 5G device for American market M50 from Teltonica Networks. And yeah, we have still some questions and we still have a few minutes to answer them. Uh, one of the first questions was, uh, could you tell a bit more about if there's uh, any different options of RMS, different, I don't know, tiers or so, and what is the pricing of RMS? Could you repeat that? Right. So uh, RMS can be sourced two ways. Basically, one one of the ways is the buy the credits. So you can purchase RMS credits from us directly or from our respected partners in North America. Uh, credit it gives you access uh, to the router via RMS for 30 days, so basically for one month. The price of the of the credit is 2.2 dollars MSRP, and uh, of course, from the partners, when you're buying in bulk and quantities, that price can be even lowered. Uh, and this is one way how you can uh, how you can use RMS. Another way is RMS packs. So we have free five and 10 year packs. Uh, the price, uh, basically, again, uh, it, it varies depending on the on the quantities and uh, uh, and uh, how how many how soon you need those. But to be like to give an example, basically, there is, let's say, opportunity to buy uh, 10 year RMS pack. It's, it's also very important, mostly to the integrators who, who needs that, you know, constant. Uh, surveillance of their their products they need to maintain and have an access to them 24 7 let's say up to 50 dollars so it's really you know unheard of i would say in the market for such a quality product and really i would uh, use a chance and uh, recommend to to try rms uh, if you have our routers already if you're planning to buy a sample that's also included so for everybody 30 days free access will access to rms it's coming with every product we sell. Directly or indirectly, uh, you will have access for 30 days to try your RMS. 
to use the functionality, right? And and to experience the benefits of, of this uh, remote management system. Yes, thank you, Itanis. Mm -hmm. uh, another question. Uh, a lot of different manufacturers are offering 5G devices, especially for industrial niche. Mm -hmm. And what is the main difference between Teltonica Networks, Root M50 and other devices? What could you say about that? I would say, uh, you know, from the outside look, uh, most of the devices look the same. They have LAN ports, right? They have Wi-Fi, they have, they have different features, but our, where we are edging is very simple, is what uh, inside the router. So RUT OS and its full extent functionality, right? Our RMS system, which gives a great uh, exposure to, the, to control and maintain the router uh, remotely. Also, our product is manufactured in Europe and uh, last but not least, we, uh, as you see, we are very price competitive with such an industrial grade uh, router and after sales support and warranty we are offering. And the lead times, uh, we stand as in the very lead spot uh, in the market at the moment. And I encourage uh, partners to really reconsider their supplier if they're not using El Teltonic RT M50 at the moment. Thank you, Vitanis. Uh, one more question regarding the RMS. Uh, can RMS be white labeled? And also, can the device UI be white labeled? As I mentioned in my presentation, yes, we are offering those services. Uh, our team in headquarters in, in Europe and Lithuania are ready to, to do these services. And uh, depending on the client requirements, we can prepare with our Teltonica's marketing team uh the the stickers the designs along with the clients team so we are in full partnership from step one to to the la to the basically the production everything what we provide can be white labeled and can be rebranded okay thank you okay and what i can see that we are limited uh to the time frame mm -hmm. and don't worry if you have unanswered questions from our side the all the questions will be answered in text form uh, after this webinar on our webpage. And if you have additional questions, please don't hesitate to contact us, uh, contact our sales team. So, uh, Vitanis, do you have something to add at this point? Also, just to close in the remarks, I want to thank for everybody for joining us, for dedicating the time. I hope it, it was useful. Again, for more information, uh, you know, leave the question here or uh, explore Teltonica Network's website or con contact your Teltonica reseller, distributor, or your account manager if you're working directly with us for more information. Uh, we are ready to shake the market with this product, I can tell you that. So thank you guys again for joining. Yeah, so thank thank you all the participants for, for joining us today. And don't forget, follow us on social media. And also please visit our website for all our uh, use cases. We have more than 200 of them. And also subscribe to our newsletter to get all the news about upcoming devices and other events. So I hope to all, all of you see soon in other our events. And so thank you very much and goodbye. Thank you guys, bye.